Welcome back, friends, followers, and transients to another episode of Banished with me, Vapor. Okay, so, um, based on the last comments, <laughs> nobody's too sure about what's going on over here. I'm guessing it's still broken. Oh, no, it's not. It's fixed. It's... Wow, okay. Well, let's get something in there quickly. <laughs> Excellent, it's fixed itself. Well, happy days. Well, we can't complain about that. How are we going to place this? Um, I guess somewhere like that. Ah, oh, that, that is absolutely perfect. Well, at least that is fixed. Um, key road. Let's write that in there while we think about it. And we probably want a double road going past. I'm going to put something different in there. It will have key road eventually, but I'm just leaving it blank so I, I remember. Okay, um... I said I'm going to do a time lapse this episode as well, and I am going to. But we're just going to continue a little bit of this um, first off camera, just so I can just so I can talk a little bit, I guess. Um, the, it was questioned as well whether or not. I'm hoping this um, this wall will go up the side here. <laughs> we'll soon find out. But it was questioned whether this was going to be in the main town. Um, what I was thinking was is having like the town hall. And those sorts of buildings, are they called municipal buildings? I don't know what they call them in America. Uh, but, you know, like this, I'm gonna, I would call it like the civic buildings, but yeah. So that kind of stuff going on here, maybe with a marketplace, and then houses and things up here, and other marketplaces, maybe some smaller chapels and things like that um, as we move up. But that's the, uh, the general plan. Let's see if we can. I'm, I'm really hoping that we can get this wall in here. Uh, Dini, mini, mini, mo. Which one was it under? This one. Oh, that sucks, doesn't it? I think we might have to nudge the church across a, a, a tiny bit. That really sucks. Okay. Well, we're gonna have to knock the church down. Whoops. Never mind. Well, while, while that's while that's happening, we can um, have a look at the graveyard. Uh, it's under this, and... No, 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 it's not that one. Here we go. Uh, we were using this, weren't we? Yes. So we've got some crypts, which I want to put in as well. We've got a fenceless cemetery, and a metal... Fe Is this...? Ah, that's like the one we're using, I see. So if we kind of give a little bit of space, something like that... Let me kind of just have a look here. Something like that. So I've got some space around the sides. We can put some pathways in. This will hold 52, so that's that's a fair amount. I'm not going to put the grips in until I can see which way the graves are facing, but there's nothing stopping me putting them elsewhere. I mean, we could have another one over this way and make the road turn that way so it's not a complete square. That might actually look quite nice. Yeah, it's going to take a little bit of time. Okay, yeah, we might do that, you know. Um, I think, is that about right? I think it is. Bearing in mind, I'm going to put some key wall along the uh, the coastline. Uh, do we... Maybe go into a smaller road, potentially? Kind of, like, go in that way. And then maybe come around the back, so it's not... Would you have? I don't know. Maybe we'll stick with the um, the full size road for the moment. So we'll we'll head off up that way, and we'll we'll put a lot of these in. Again, I may move some of these um, over time. Um, I'm not 100% sure yet because you just don't know what's going to happen. We need to connect. Oh, this is the railway. Ooh, completely forgot about that. So that's got to come in, and we can't put the railway. And oh, ooh, maybe we can. I'm not sure. If, have a look. Oh, we can go over the road. That might be an interesting, um, interesting thing to do. <laughs> we'll have to try that at some point. Aha, the church is gone. So, why do I keep going into that one? This one, is it one of these? Not that one. I was also told that some of the churches have the um, the F variant, so there's, there's different versions of it. Uh, maybe I should put that fence in first, just in case. Because knowing my luck, it will completely go wrong. Look at all the resources we get from that, though. <laughs> Not that we need them. How are we doing for stuff? 
Oh, we're looking okay up there. And a single piece. Perfect. So if we do this right, we should have... At least... Mm, let's go for two spaces. There we go. Works perfectly. And that means then we can run the... Is this one? Yep. We can run this up here. I'll try and keep that as tight to the uh, road as possible. Again, I do want to put some some trees and bushes along the side, which I think which I think will look quite cool. But I only want the one entrance. I don't. I've not even been watching. Do they walk through this fence? Is it a passable object? No, they don't walk through it. That is good to know. Oh no, they just did there. <laughs> it's really odd. It's kind of one minute they, they don't seem to, and the next minute they do. This is going to be a fairly big place. I'm tempted to put another graveyard here. Because I think this if this is going to be the main one, um, I'm potentially a house behind where the, uh, the priest would live. So maybe if we come to about, say, here... This is actually turning out a lot bigger than I initially planned. Have I left a gap in there? No. Might have helped if I removed the trees first. But I think I think we can just about manage. If I do kind of leave any gaps, there is um, the one little piece of it anyway. So kind of getting there. There we go. I'm not sure what house we're going to use, but we will use one. And then I think we've got another graveyard over here. We'll leave the same sort of space in. One like that way. Um, leave a gap, say that wide. And that's the wrong one. We want, want the fenceless one. Try that again. Like so. Perfect. Then we can have the house over this side. Behind the church itself, I think. And I think that'll work quite well. Which way? Ah, the graves are facing that way. Perfect. Which means I can... Well, the thing is, it depends where we put these. I might aim them more towards the... Oh, would you, would you have them somewhere separate? Over here, there is different types of gravestone like this. And there is more elaborate stuff, but they just appear to me to be kind of like slap bang in the middle of the other stuff so would we have them like separately maybe up here I might need to do a bit of research on that or oh, you guys can let me know in the comments because uh, I, won't, I won't necessarily finish that today okay let's have a quick look at houses and then we may jump to a time lapse I mean some of these buildings could potentially be classed as a house but let's see now we don't want anything like that, a wood cabin. There is some buildings with that roof on it, I think. Aha. Uh -huh. But it doesn't, I don't feel like it fits. It would look better if it was brick. Not one of those, not one of those. I like those, but not really. Hmm. Again, same tile, but... Prefer brick. Oh, there goes a lot of trees. Hmm, these are the no, definitely not them. Although it is a very similar it is a very similar roof tile. No. These are a bit bright, aren't they, as well? Hmm. We might get away with one of those farm style houses. But that would be nice if it wasn't so red. I'm really particular, as you can tell. Oh, that's not going to work. What have we got in here? Oh, these are the... Uh, yep. Yeah. Wow, that is a nice building. Huh. We'll have to have a go at that at some point. What have we got in here? Oh, are these like the, the Spanish-style buildings? I think they are, aren't they? Yeah. 
I've never really looked at those before. These are quite nice. It's a shame that they haven't got like a tiled roof version. Um, these are... Hmm. They kind of would work. Potentially. Yep. I'm just trying to kind of uh, reacquaint myself with some of this stuff. Because um, it's been a while since I've seen some of it. The artisan house, captain's house. No, these look. They're gonna look a bit weird because these look like they all should be attached to something else. I guess. Hmm. Which one was it? There was something back. Oh, wow, these. I didn't click these, did I? Huh. Um, there was something here. Maybe these. I know it looks slightly different, but... I think that will probably fit the best. Let's have it, like, literally... There's no doors in the back or anything, is there? No. Let's have it kind of right tucked away in the corner. I think that will work. Unless you guys know of a, a different variant that would um, look quite good. But I think... Um, I think we're about at the right point to do a bit of a time lapse. So I'll be back right after that.
Well, that was uh, quite a bit of work there, um, just to get all those pieces in. Uh, let me change the uh, season back. There we go. Something a little bit nicer. Um, I don't know what you guys think. I don't really want to add too much more. Because I feel like it would be cramped. I'm tempted to put some lights around the side here. But I can't really put them on the diagonal because the ones I'm using don't have a diagonal variant, unfortunately. Um, so it would look really odd because they go at right angles. So yeah, we're kind of stuck with that. But I don't know what you think. You'd have to have to let me know. Should I add more? Should I change anything? I mean, I'm quite happy with it. I think it works quite well. We've got a ship here coming in. The only thing I did notice is some of the traders are taking this river as opposed to that one, which is a little bit strange. But why are you standing in, in the middle of the air? We've got a little bit of a glitch here. Hmm. I've probably put... And here. Maybe one too many um, squares. I'm probably going to remove this key wall to, to get to that, that piece that's here that's bothering it, but never mind. And we have a, a nice little welcome sign as well. And uh, a sign to the market. I might change that later on. I was just messing around with it. And um, what else did we do? We filled this in. Oh, wait a minute. I didn't put in the... Um, the uh, ghost squares, these things are just... Like these things are a lifesaver. They're, they're, they're like the uh, the cherry on the cake, so to speak. Just to finish those annoying little areas. I mean, I don't mind a little bit of like grass along the edge because in certain circumstances, it can look really good. But not not in this case. Um, how are we getting on over here? Okay, yeah, we're getting quite a few graves coming in. We have to remove um, all this grass and stuff. I'm just wondering if I should use a different pathway. Because um, we, we do have some different choices. I'm thinking we should probably use a different path. Personally, I think that might be might be a good idea. But maybe something similar to the road, but not quite the same. Maybe this. How's that? In fact, what we're we using up here? We're using some kind of brick. Hmm. Do we have something that resembles that, I wonder? Let's have a see up here. Uh, grass, gravel, stone, wood. Do we class this stone? Probably. Is it that? Looks similar to that, but I don't think it is. It might work, though. Yeah, I think we'll I think we'll um, we'll go for that. The slightly annoying thing is is the entrance is slightly off now. Um, no, let's remove the before someone starts doing it. We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna have to move this because yeah, I can't deal with it. Uh, which one did we select now? So I'm gonna I'm gonna have lost the road we're using. There it is. So if we do that, and I know exactly where I'm putting it. Um, if we come up here, I don't know if I should do a double road on that. I mean, that was part of the reason I left the extra space, but um, depending now, if we're going to put any crypts over here, I'm going to do that, but then run off a road, uh, maybe this way, towards this house. Where's the door? It's there. So, something like that. Yeah, I guess it really depends on the crypts. Because I'm not sure exactly where we're going to put them. Uh, graveyard, graveyard. It's in here. And we need... Which one of these is the gate? This one. What have we got? Two open, closed, one open. I think we'll go with that. And then we're missing a piece there. That should work quite nicely. That's not a bad stone. I don't mind that. It is kind of similar to that one. I think that will work quite nicely. And then I think probably bushes and trees along the edge. Um, yeah, you know, things like these. I think I prefer these. It's a shame this like 
not many different variants of this because they're going to look almost repetitive once I start doing that and I'm not sure what other tree we could put some birch just to break it up I suppose let's have a have a look how this will look so that's left two squares so if we loot two as well maybe we can do something like this it's all different ones isn't it so let's see if we can move that one leaning that way slightly and well that worked out quite well that one that was literally leaning into that tree I think that'll look good now and I think Potentially, we'll just use the dark green bush, maybe. In fact, there's a different... Oh, we're in autumn. I was going to say, it's kind of a funny colour. It's not quite dark green. Oh, even the medium green. Oh, what about the lavender? That might actually work, because it's not too tall, so it might... If we just kind of rotate it around a little bit, so it doesn't look the same every single time. Maybe something like that. It's hard to tell because the season's changing, but we'll let that do its um, do its thing. I guess the road we put are these ghost ones? Did we put ghost? No, they're not. So <laughs> we need to do something different. I'm just wondering what road to put. Do we do soil? I mean, we could potentially. Where is it? Ghost. This. Yeah, we could use that. It's going to encroach slightly onto the uh, onto the grave area, but I think it could work. Oh, the terrain's a little bit bumpy there. Hopefully, that will uh, get fixed. If it oh wait, a minute, that's going to go through, isn't it? Where's the corner piece? Not that one. Although, we wouldn't have a corner piece here, would we? Because we would be going round a corner. Right. So, if we're kind of like here, I guess, would we be using... No, we wouldn't be using that one. Yeah, so it'd be like that, wouldn't it? I don't know if I can adjust the terrain here or not. Oh, I can't. But I can't do the bit where the grave is, unfortunately. <laughs> Slightly known. Well, I can, but I can't. I'd have to remove the whole graveyard. It's probably best that I flatten this before doing any more work, I think. Stop clicking on that same place. There we go. So we shouldn't, <laughs> we shouldn't have that problem again. Fingers crossed. I think maybe that one's a little bit too far across now. That's the only thing. I don't know. I've never, I've never been like a huge fan of this. I don't. I think it, it becomes a little bit too much. I mean, we could use the soil, and we could just go back to, what the road decoration things, or where are they? Oh, the key, the key wall trim. We could use that. Okay, that one won't go in anywhere here because it likes a little bit of its own space. So I guess that would mean the key wall trim, which, not that one. That might work better. Like so. And if I wanted to, I could do it on the other side as well to, to kind of ignore that little bit of green that you can see behind there. And in, in a way... You wouldn't necessarily notice that once all the trees are in bloom, but yeah, you know, I know it's there. And that's that's where a lot of the problems come from because I know it's there. I have to do something about it. Yeah, so something like that. We could do that the whole way around. Can we not get the road underneath that piece of gate? Because that sucks. Oh, we can. I just neglected to put it in. It is a, it's a very similar stone to what's going on here, so I think that, that works fairly well. I feel like I've achieved quite a bit though. We've got quite a bit going on. At least, this this to me feels finished. I don't know, like like I said earlier, let me know in the comments. Um, it's nice to have something 100% finished. Still got to do a bit of tinkering. We're going to have to do another time lapse at some point. And we've got to figure out where this train is going to be going. 
because he's got to get over here to the main docks. So it can't really go this way, not unless we have a track that runs down the side of the embankment of the river. That might be interesting, because we're going to have to have a track shooting off up here into town as well. Hmm. I'm not too sure how we're going to deal with that. Any suggestions, I would appreciate. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. But until next time, as always, take care.